Welcome again on this web application penetration testing series. My name is Sumit Jain and today I'm going to discuss about how to find vulnerabilities using AFROG. So AFROG is a customizable vulnerability scanner which can help you to find default credential sensitive information leakage, unauthorized access, arbitrary file reading and command execution. By using AFROG, we can scan a single domain or a list of multiple domains as per our requirement. So AFROG is a Go-based tool and it uh, it doesn't come up with our default Kali Linux distribution. So we have to install it first. You can easily find it on GitHub's repository named uh, Zenit in. So here is the command for the installation of the tool. It is a simple command. You can run in your terminal sudo go install hyphen v then provide the GitHub URL for the tool and provide the path where you want to store the tool. So after the installation, we have to provide our target domain or multiple domain file. And so that we need to collect our subdomains for our specified target. Here is the list of tools I use for subdomain enumeration. Subfinder, Asset Finder, MS, and Ltrax. Ltrax is a new tool created by Project Discovery. So give it a shot to discover your subdomains. I already told about the subdomain enumeration part in my previous videos. You can watch these videos. So after the collection of domains, we have to run AFROG on our target file. So here is the use case of AFROG. You can use a single domain for a scan, called, uh, specify the hyphen T flag for a single domain. If you have a target list, of multiple domains, you can specify hyphen T capital flag. And if you have a URL file, you can specify hyphen T as well. And if you want to store the result, you can specify hyphen O flag. So let's try a frog on a domain. I'm here. I'm using tesla.com. I already collected the subdomains or not our target. So here is my file. It have already multiple domains of tesla.com. I am using a frog on single domain. So I have specified hyphen T and our domain name tesla.com and hit enter. It will analyze the target first and sh show you the use cases and the results. A frog created seven 115 queries to test this domain. I'm forcefully stopping here the command and show you how to uh, scan multiple domains. So you need to specify a frog hyphen capital T and your subdomain list. This is my subdomain list. Hit enter. Now a frog will analyze the subdomains you specified for live domains or the domains with 404 output then it will create use cases and show you the scan result.